So I'm Katerina Mutsatsos. I directed, I wrote, directed, and produced Loverly. I have a Greek and French upbringing. I grew up in Greece, in Athens, and Paris. Uh, having a career in, in Greece and then um, creating a, some sort of path in neighboring Turkey was uh, my whole career actually for about 11 years. I needed some I needed a change. I needed to challenge myself. I was I was I guess successful, but somehow something was missing. I, I just wanted to try something new. I believed I deserved to be doing my work on the highest level possible. I figured that the best would be for me to come to LA. That was my that was my thinking at the time. And that is still my thinking today. I was born here and, and I had my passport, so I came over here to just check it out. I spent a couple of years trying to figure things out and I realized that the best way for me to go is create my own things. I'm creative enough, I can just create my own stories. And I mean, when you're an actor, it's you're kind of powerless. You're just waiting for other people to either hire you or discover you or most actors that come to Hollywood have to find other ways of, of, of you know recreating themselves because unless you get the ba the best agent right away and you're represented by you know this amazing people that have all these powers to get you the best jobs you have to find a way of doing things yourself. Loverly was not my first script. Um, it was my my second script, but it's the first one that that came to to be realized. I had once an experience with a director. Um, there are some good directors and some bad directors out there, and and that was a bad one. And I think I, you know, I had an experience enough to be objective about it. And after that bad experience, I, I said to myself, oh, you know what? Maybe I can direct. I would already directed the movie in the script. I guess I was always, you know, adding a directorial touch and it, it just came natural to me to, to direct Loverly after I, I'd finished the script. Directing and acting at the same time is pretty hard, but it's, really great. If, if you've done enough preparation for both, then um, you feel very comfortable. It's totally, it was totally possible and, and it worked out well. It was really hard directing, I guess, the love scene. It was a bit uncomfortable, but my co-star Andy Gillet was just amazing and so we had a great laugh. I was just directing naked. <laughs> Most of the people involved in this movie are non-actors, so it was really hard to, um, you know, have to convince all these people that they could be acting in my movie, and I did convince them, and it was hard after that to put everyone's schedule together. There were over 25 people involved in this movie, and that was the hardest part. So I, I just play a regular woman falls in love, has a relationship, but what's special about that woman is the path that she puts herself into. Andy Gillet is just um, is a great actor. He is, he's a great person. He was very professional, very funny, very handsome, perfect cast. It's just perfect. Like I couldn't have dreamt of a better cast for, for this particular role. I mean, I was really lucky. I was very lucky. Um, a feature film, a Greek, um, Greek and Turkish, I mean, it's a Greek film. I wrote it. I'm hoping to be able to realize it in the next few months, start pre-production. 30% of it takes place in Istanbul. I'm willing to, to give to give myself full time to this project right after I, I, I put Loverly off the ground. <laughs>